a very good morning to you all children welcome to nivedita school online classes so in last video we have studied about the first chapter right which was the first chapter different kinds of plants very good so today we are going to revise the lesson once again let's get deep into the lesson okay yes children what do you see in this picture yeah we see different types of plants right plants and trees yes look some are tall and some are short yeah look here small plants yes children you can see here small plants and some are of different shapes one is in like bushy like an umbrella shape one is in triangle shape yes yeah it is in cone shape yes children by this what we can say trees are of different shapes and different sizes yeah trees are of different shape yeah in this picture only you can see it is it has very different shapes and also different size look some are tall some are short that is called size right look here it is it is in cone shape right in the top it is very thin but at the bottom it is very broad but here it is opposite in the bottom it is thin but at the top it is broad yeah yes children we can see here itself yeah it is very different trees are of different size and shapes some are of medium size some are very big yeah some plants are big some plants are medium size and some plants are very small very small plants means you can see the grass these are grass right these are also the plants but they are very small yeah children compared to the trees and the plants these all are very small and some are of medium size look at these plants are medium size right these all are medium size yes children now here what do you see there is a tree right it looks so beautiful right yes children yeah look here it's like an mushroom right have you seen the mushrooms yeah just take a look of a mushroom if you go and i uh, see the mushroom means it looks somewhat like this only yeah the shape of the mushroom is also like this only it's like an umbrella shape yes yeah so let us study about the tree what are trees yeah tall big strong plants are called trees yes tall and big plants look this plant is big right and also strong and also tall yeah and these are called trees yeah trees can stand straight and has a stem called a trunk some branches grow from the trunk yes children trees can stand straight look it has stood the straight right right straight it is standing and it has hard stem this is called stem right yeah it is very hard and it's called as a trunk yeah and some branches are grown from the trunk itself look the branches these are called branches can you see these are called branches in the next photo you can see look the stem this is a stem of the tree look how hard it is yeah compared to the other trees and the other plants it is strong right this is called a trunk these are called the branches remember children these are called the branches it is very important to remember this is called trunk these are called branches these all are branches and what this head some branches grow from the trunk yeah look this is trunk right from here the trunk starts from here to till down where the roots are there till there the tree has a trunk look from the trunk itself the branches have been grown yeah 
these are branches right i have said you remember children these are branches this is a trunk yes next photo you see here yeah even this tree has a trunk but it has different shape yeah we have said right plants are of different shapes and sizes yeah they doesn't look the same all the trees and plants look very different look here it is very strong but here look it is thin right it is thin and it has different shape itself but here the tree is very different yeah this is the trunk and some branches have grown grown from the trunk itself they have said look at the trunk uh, branches which is grown from the trunk only yeah in this which is branches children can you identify the branches yes these are the branches and this is called a trunk and look the down part what are these yeah these are the roots okay the roots of the tree trees have very strong roots okay trees have very strong roots the roots are under the soil but here the roots are little bit on the top because the what the plants the trees doesn't have so much of place because all the place have been covered with the roots there will be no place to go inside for the sake only the roots have come on the top yeah okay look here you can see so many branches still run here can you identify the branches and the trunk yes the down part from here till the down part it is called as a trunk and these all are the branches look so many branches this, uh, the tree has right in this tree also you can see the second one here also there are so many branches yes children now you can understand right you can say me what are branches and what are tree what are trunk yeah the down part is called as a trunk very hard stem is called as a trunk and branches these all are the branches yes what are trees now children can you say me yeah trees are tall big and strong plants yeah they are tall big and strong plants are called trees so here you can see I have said the different sizes right trees are of different size some trees are very small look look at this tree it is small right yeah and another one is little bit taller yeah and another some trees are very large tree they are totally fully tall yeah some are very tall some are of medium and some are small trees yes next look here example is a banyan tree children this is called as a banyan tree look how big it is yeah and look at the leaves yeah and also the branches have gone till the end look so hard the branches are there yeah strong it is very strong branch right banyan tree is very strong tree they can live for more than 100 years children okay banyan trees are very strong they are tall strong and huge very big tree okay they live for more than 100 years yes look here you can see how big the tree is look so much big right look at the branches children look here the branches how it has grown gone right look there is a girl here she is standing there but she is looking very small in this picture because the tree is very big yeah if you go and stand under the tree you will look very small one because the tree the tree is so much huge tree yeah this which uh, what is the name of the tree 
it is a banyan tree children remember it's an banyan tree next now which tree is this which tree is this can you name yes it's gulmora tree it's an gulmora tree look at the flowers the leaves yeah the leaves are green in color you can see here the leaves are in green color yeah but it has so much of flowers yeah it is a flower giving plant tree look even this tree has a trunk can you identify the trunk this is called as a trunk yeah this is called as a trunk and can you identify the branches you can see branches right here yeah these are the branches children yeah these all are the branches yes now we have got taro with the trees right what are trees trees are tall big and strong plants they have hard stem hard stem called trunk very hard right you can see here so much big huge hard trunk yeah and they can stand straight they do, do not need any support without support it is standing right yeah yes next we have to plant trees children trees are very important for us yeah as i said trees purifies the air yeah it gives us clean air for that sake we have to plant the trees yeah okay children next for you there is a homework children what you have to do means you have to write any three examples for the tree leaving from the test book you have to not list out from the test book outside of the test book you have to search different types of tree and same in the online class trees i have said the trees not the plants don't confuse trees trees are very big plants plants are small one small one are called plant the tall and big strong are called trees remember any three examples of the trees you have to answer me in the online class yes now we are going to study about the shrubs now shrubs are of different sizes some shrubs are very short and some are of medium size and some are very tall shrub large shrub it grows big one yeah look here the in dam dam or any park if you go means there will be a line like plants yeah plant will be planted in line and they have cut they will cut in a shape right look they have cut in a shape yes they have cut in a shape right yeah these are also called as a shrub if you go to the dam you can see that there will be a plants which have been cutted in shapes one will be cutted uh, one will be in chopped like a uh, chair type or different shape yeah those are uh, those are also called as a shrub example for shrubs are mehndi plant look this is called as a mehndi plant yeah mehndi plant is also a shrub in your textbook if you see means page number 53 yeah there is a rose shrub rose plant is also called as a shrub yeah trees are tall but the shrubs are smaller than the trees yeah they are much smaller look does it is grown as a tree no right it's very short and bushy but the trees they grow tall and strong but these are smaller one they are much smaller yeah compared to the trees look here there is a hibiscus 
plant yes look how the flower is it's in red color right yes look this is a shrub hibiscus shrub it is grown in a bushy way yeah but it is not so much tall as a tree trees are very much tall but the hibiscus plant is small short yeah they are smaller than the trees and the shrubs have many branches children look they are so many branches but they will be thin but not hard as a tree ha tree has hard stem right but the shrubs have thin stem yeah the plants smaller than the trees are called shrubs so what are shrubs the plants smaller than the trees are called shrubs remember children the plants smaller than the trees are called shrubs yes now we got an idea what are shrubs and trees trees are very tall and strong and uh, they stand straight but the shrubs are short. look here how short the shrub is yeah they are very much smaller than the tree yes trees are very big but the uh, shrubs are very small yes so what is your work is you have to list some more shrub living from the test book yeah you have to list some more shrubs and you have to say me that also in the online classes yes children what is your homework for the online class your homework for the online class is tomorrow only you should do this work yeah what you should do you should list any three trees you have to list any three trees and you have to list some example of shrub plants which are shrubs yeah shrub plants you have to list down yes so i hope you all understood today's class so let's meet in the next video until then bye take care happy learning